Just a spoonful of sugar helps the medicine go down in a most delightful This way. August marks the 50th anniversary of her Oscar-winning performance in Mary Poppins. She looked very hot as a brunette, by the way. She's a very successful author collaborating with her daughter on children's books. Her latest, The Very Fairy Princess Graduation Girl, the lovely Julie Andrews. Thank you for joining us. Hello, Pete. How are you? I am fantastic. I have to say, you look beautiful as a brunette. I always forget about that. (laughs) (laughs) Thank you. You're a sweetheart. (laughs) You know, I looked this up. Is this your 28th book with your daughter? Is that right? Yes, uh, 29th, actually, because there's another one that's already been written and is out next year. Um, We've been writing together for about 17 years, but actually I've been uh, writing books for about... Well, about 40 years now. I think I was the original uh, celebrity author, which is a horrible uh, uh, <laughs> moniker to have to adopt. But um, I didn't think about it at the time. Well, I have to tell you, uh, it's very impressive when I see an actress who uh, was a singer and was a great actress, and now you do voiceover work uh, with all those animated films that you do, and you're such a successful author, and you work with your daughter. A lot of people don't work. That's the best part, believe me. It's such a joy. I never guessed when she was my, uh, my... My little girl, that uh, singing to my hip, so to speak, that we would one day be facing each other across the table as, as equals. And uh, it is a joy. Well, a lot of people don't work well with uh, family, Julie. Uh, well, you know what? We, uh, unbelievable, I think we have a lot of mutual respect. We have very different talents that we contribute to our, to our books. And um, she's, uh, she's more the... Um, nuts and bolts of the books, the structure, the first act, second act, third act, so to speak. And I'm more the big idea, the flights of fancy, the opening chapters and and, uh, descriptive pieces. And somehow um, we've never had an argument. We have a lot of creative discussions. It's usually the best idea wins. Mm Mm-hmm. We're talking with Julie Andrews. The name of her new children's book is called The Very Fairy Princess Graduation Girl. Can you believe it's been 50 years ago, Mary Poppins? No, and coming up is the Sound of Music 50 years, too. So, uh, my gosh, it's it's mind-boggling. Where and what happened? I mean, uh, <laughs> where did that time go? Well, I have an 8-year-old, and it's fun to watch these films again, and I forgot how funny Dick Van Dyke was. I mean, he... Oh, he's such a dear man and a great friend, has stayed a great friend all these years. But if you have an 8-year-old, I hope you read... Uh, to your kid a lot every single day julie every single Ah, day absolutely best possible thing because emma and i are just passionate advocates for that and and um and also for literacy and uh, how much the the written word matters you know right well you mentioned the sound of music the first movie i ever saw on the big screen at a drive-in theater was the sound of music i want to say i was in third or fourth grade and i (laughs) fell asleep during the movie (laughs) <laughs> well, it's typical for a boy, I guess. <laughs> but it seems like The Sound of Music is usually on every single year. They play the Ten Commandments, you know, the uh, the Moses film, uh, Easter yes. weekend, and then the following weekend is usually The Sound of Music, so we all grew up watching it. I don't know. It's, uh, I mean, how lucky can anyone get to have been asked to make that beautiful movie? And uh, I was the lucky one. And um, I, it, it is one of those beautifully crafted movies that does stand the test of time, you know? Well, why is that? Because it's a love story and it's about children and the music. I mean, when my son comes home from school and they sing Doe a Deer at school, you know that it stood the test of time. Well, I guess that's why it is. It's about family. It's about safety. It's about feeling good and, and doing something creative. And uh, and uh, with all that beautiful scenery and and uh, seven children and uh, mm-hmm. and having fun and also some uh, wonderful adventure thrown in, I guess it's got a little bit of everything. But it, it, the music is lovely. Was it hard making uh, clothes out of drapes for the kids? <laughs> My little fingers were rude. <laughs> we're, t- <laughs> we're talking with Julie Andrews. You know, I mentioned your name, and people love you. You're you're the person that everyone wants as their favorite aunt. Do you get that a lot? I'm lucky, I do, and I love them. I love meeting people, and um, I do think these great films that I've been fortunate to be in have, have been the kind of, uh, been 
the road that led me to meet all these people, and um, I, I enjoy it very much. And when did you start doing animated films? Because you've done Shrek, you did Despicable Me. Um... That's right. Uh, well, it, I love trying new things, and um, I wasn't sure I could do the mum in Despicable Me. She's such a terrible <laughs> woman, but great. Great fun to play her, I can tell you. I'm, I'm telling you, Julie, I've seen that movie probably 432 times. Despicable Aren't you in me. love with the Minions? I am. Everybody loves the Minions. You know, we... Oh, my God, what a wonderful invention. I, I wish I'd thought of it. Wow. So do you have any animated films? Am I going to hear your voice any time this summer? What do you have coming uh, well, up? There's a, a, a Despicable Me 3 that, uh, that's being talked about, I believe, and I think that's in, in uh, the creative works right now. Um, so I uh, expect that. It will be forthcoming. Um, and then, uh, fortunately, a, a couple of my books are being talked about for um, the screen, and I uh, hope they come to pass, although that'll be a while because they do take a long time. You know, you, you get Mary Poppins mentioned, you get Sound of Music mentioned. What's another movie? Is it 10? Is it uh, Victor Victoria? What? It's probably Victor Victoria uh, or 10, or um, sometimes Thoroughly Modern Millie. Um, uh, sometimes, uh, oh, you know, working with my husband was another great joy, and uh, all the movies that I did with him, I personally enjoyed. But I think it's probably um, Princess Diaries too is often mentioned for children. Were you friends with Peter Sellers in the Pink Panther movies? Oh yes, indeed. I mean, I was with Blake when they were made, and and uh, uh, he was a oh, huge talent, a, a very. Uh, a man who who suffered great depressions and and highs and lows, but, right. but to watch him uh, and to laugh with him, uh, I mean, the, 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 always the sets and the work was great fun. Well, your husband's uh, the Blake Edwards, his uh, Pink Panther movies. I mean, stands the test of time. Those are still one of the funniest movies you've ever seen. Aren't they just? And we we actually uh, in our family for years we've been uh, speaking quote speaking Clouseau, and uh, it, it's just natural, natural speech for us. You know? <laughs> and you brought up Victor Victoria. You took off your top in that movie, didn't you? Uh, actually, that was SOB. SOB, uh, I'm sorry. Well, I guess it looked like I did in Victor Victoria, <laughs> but in SOB I really did. And that that was written 10 years before it was finally uh, brought to the screen, so I had a lot of time to think about that. So were you okay with that? Well, you know... It was being directed by my husband, and it was a very valid topless moment. It was part of the idiocy of that film and the <laughs> screenplay of that film. And so, uh, yeah, I was nervous, but uh, there's so many funny stories surrounding it. If I had another hour, I'd tell them to you. Oh, man. Well, the uh, Very Fairy Princess Graduation Girl is Julie Andrews' new book, along with her daughter. Julie, it really is a pleasure to talk to you. And if you're ever in Chicago, we'd love to have you stop by just so we can all hug you. Oh, I love that. <laughs> so let's, let's uh, plan that sometime in the future. Julie Andrews. Thank you, Julie. We'll talk soon. Okay, Pete. Thank you. Have a, have a lovely evening. You too. It's 720 WGN. And they